Why should any gay teenager have to be confused and hide their sexuality instead of proudly coming out? Some kids are raised by a, a family that frowns upon that a lot and for various reasons, personal, religious, there's all kinds of reasons why suppression would be important to the family or to the individual. So. I think it's great that we live in a time when there are many examples, uh, not only in real life, but on TV and in social media, f of people who are uh, living a, a happy existence, uh, free of the constraints of concern about what people are thinking of them. And that's a, a good place to be in. But it's such an individual process. There's people that don't have those realizations until they're 60 years old. And I don't think that means they've lived a crappy life until they're 60. It's just little baby steps of weird, of weird, unique things that have happened to them. And I was very fortunate that I had a lot of weird, unique things happen to me. Uh, out with the cast of the touring company of Rent in Boston. It was the first national tour and I saw the show and I just wanted to know them all because the Rent is such a great piece. And then I, I met them because they were all in hotels and I was in a hotel making a movie. And didn't have many friends and they took me in and this world of people were so accepting and lovely and, and, and creative and they sang and they danced and they laughed and they were black and white and Asian and old and young and gay and straight and, and, and people, their partners had died and some had never dated before and it was just like this amazing group of people that were just thriving and I thought I'd want to spend my time around these kind of people. I don't want to spend my time around people that are super worried in a lemming way about how that w will be taken. I want to be around people that are embracing things. Because when, I don't know, I feel like when you do things like that, if, if it goes wrong, then, you, then that's okay. You learn from that and you go a different direction. But to live such a boxed in life, at a certain point you're gonna act out or lash out or freak out and that's not good for anyone. Your kids, your parents, your spouse, whatever, right? So, um, so I don't think all people should just be okay with who they are. That's not how the world works.